Uh, when you all thought of joining Kairos or Cheryl, when you know you were asked or whether you want to contribute, what was the commitment that you thought you were looking at? Was mm-hmm. were you thinking of a few years, or did you know that it's going to just go on My forever? Because I think I think that's a good thing to think about for especially new editors, you know, who are joining in, and you know, what can what can what should they be thinking about? Yeah, that's a great question. Um, no, we had no idea. I had no idea what I was getting into. And certainly, mm-hmm. I mean, when I joined, the journal was only five years old. So I had no sense of how long it was going to run. I knew at the time that editors like um, I worked with Marilyn Cooper when I was at Michigan Tech, and she was doing her three year stint with a three or four year stint with um, three C's. And but I also had Cindy self as a model who was editor for life of computers and composition, right? Until she and Gail knew they were retiring and and Chris Blair got the job. Um, So there were models for people doing it for a very long time, Chris running CNC online and Peg Syverson before her. Um, But but no, I had, I was just like, oh, let me try this out. And then when I realized that it was like, oh, I can stay in this for as long as I want. Oh my God. it was, uh, I was like, okay, then I need to start, you know, doing, I need to make sure that I'm doing good things for the, for the journal all, all along. But it also helped me realize as we started an official training, hiring and training and mentoring program for the staff that we needed to give them an out if they needed it. Um, and so we started saying, okay, we're going to hire you for a two year stint. And then uh, it's up to you to determine whether you want to keep going or not, right? Um, and it also gives us an out on the rare, rare, rare case that somebody's just not working out, not doing their, their work, not meeting deadlines, that, that kind of thing. Um, but yeah, if you look around the staff right now, we have some long timers here. And the folks who can't uh, or, or aren't able to, to continue for whatever reason, they're usually gone within two to three years, um, sometimes quicker. Um, and that's, that's okay. 